In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize an EUV uh, FDTD with Fourier boundary condition mass technology. We're going to customize it and change it so that it, it's a quad layer mirror instead of a bi layer multi layer mirror. But first, we're going to set up as much as we can here before we customize it. Okay, uh, let's customize it. When we customize it, we see that we have a rigorous simulation that uses an FBC, a Fourier boundary condition. But we're going to change it to FBC with a variable film stack. Then we have our materials here. We'll add another material. We'll call this a blend material. MOSI blend. And we'll we'll use the um, indices here and make them an average of them. Make the N and K of this an average of these two indices. Okay. Okay, and then we'll give it a color and we'll go to the film stack. <clears throat> now what we're going to do is parameterize this. First we're going to delete all of the other bilayers so that we just have one of our base combination layers. We're going to parameterize it. This would be D, which is the bilayer spacing, times 1 minus gamma minus gamma 2. Gamma, or D, is going to be 6.95. Gamma is 0.4, and gamma 2 is 0.1. This is going to be D times gamma minus gamma 2. Now we'll insert, add a layer below. This is going to be D times gamma 2, and this is going to be the blend. All right, and we'll add a layer below here, D times gamma 2, and make this the blend. And so now we will uh, simulate this, or sorry, now we will repeat this for a total of 40 repetitions. And the nice thing about it is we can change the blend layer thickness. So we'll run two values, 0 and 0.1. So what we can expect to see here is that we have more contrast when we have a perfect mirror and a little bit less contrast when we have a mirror that has this blended material in there. And our aerial image at best focus should show this. There we go. When gamma 2 is 0, we have a little more contrast. That's the black curve. And then the red curve, we have a little less contrast. Now, the nice thing also is that we can s export this as a template. Save it here. And now, any other, we could give this template to another person, and they could experiment with simulating a quad-layer, multi-layer mirror where there's a, a blend material between the silicon and molybdenum.